Hey guys, it's me Dave from the Kodo, back again with another guide for you on Pokemon Legends Arceus. I am doing the Arcane boss fight, Arcanine boss fight here, the Noble Lord of the Isles. Now, he has a couple of moves you have to dodge. One is where he'll sprint across the uh, place, and one is where he'll jump. That's the beginning couple of moves, and you have to stay out of the lava, the lava will hurt you. But the main thing is you're going to want to do is you're going to throw these bombs at him to knock down his health. Uh, like you can see here, you can dodge through his his uh, his runs. So just wait for a break time, dodge. While you're in the middle of dodge, you're invincible, so if you get hit by it, you're fine. So just watch out for those. He'll do a jump where he jumps to the middle. And these little balls above his head, you want to hit him so these go away. Because if you miss, if you mess up on that, he's going to hit you very hard. And you'll see later on in the fight, I'm too far away from him because he put some fire in the middle. Uh, so I can't get to him. So there's his jump to the middle, and then he'll keep doing his running back and forth. But like I said, the main thing he's going to be doing is going to be doing his running back and forth. When he has the five fireballs above his head, when you knock those away, he'll become incapacitated, and you can throw a Pokemon at him and battle him and knock him down a little bit more. In that last one, I messed up. That's so why I wasn't able to get my Pokemon out in time. I just kept throwing the, the bombs at him, which is fine. You can do it this way, too. Keep dodging him here. Once he gets down a little bit past half health, which he is now, he'll do this where he'll, uh, he'll leave some fire in the middle. That'll hurt you if you step into it, so watch out for it. This is basically all I do. I almost I get very close to dying, but I don't. Uh, just keep dodging his moves here, and you'll see the point at which I mess up where he has the balls above his head, and I'm too far away to knock him down. He does a massive attack, which does a lot of damage. So, pretty simple fight. Uh, bring a water Pokemon, definitely, because uh, you're fighting fire. See right here? I, I can't get him. He does this huge attack. Now, not even expecting what's going to happen here. A massive amount of attack. It hits everything. So you want to be able to knock those away. But that fire in the middle made it a little bit harder. And every time he jumps in the middle, it goes back. So just wait for him to charge at you. Uh, when he charges at you, you're on the same side, he'll, he'll turn around and face 180 degrees backwards, so then you can just keep firing at him, and he won't run at you when you're right next to him. So, hopefully this was helpful to you, you're able to beat this guy, get this part of the story done. If you have any questions, put them in the comment section below. Hit that like button if it was helpful, but like always guys, good luck, and have fun.